Hello everyone, this video will introduce cross-device linkage feature of HyperConnect. Go to home page, site. We take size powers as example. Open linkage lure page. You can use six predefined templates to add linkage lure, including intrusion, forced entry alarm, back to home office, away, visit the calling, and primitive zone alarm. Each of the six templates is designed for typical applications of the linkage lure. Let me introduce six alarm templates first. Intrusion template is used for improving security level by triggering linkage action including capture, recording, and alarm output when intrusion events occurs. And linkage actions will be triggered when people, vehicles, or other objects on their predefined area. The first entry alarm template is used for improving security level by triggering linkage action, including capture, recording, remaining door closed, alarm output, and calling preset when line crossing detection occurs. And the linkage action will be triggered when people, vehicles, or other objects cross the predefined virtual line. The back to home or office template is used for lowering the security level and enabling privacy protection by triggering the linkage action, including disarming and enabling privacy mask when you are back to home or office. The way template. It used for improving security level and counseling privacy protection by triggering the linkage action including arming or disabling privacy mask when you leave your home or office. Visitor calling template. It used for improving security level by triggering the linkage action including capture and recording when visitors are calling from the door station. Perimeter Zom Alarm Template is used for improving security level by triggering linkage action including capture, recording, calling preset, alarm output, and remaining door closed if people or other objects are detected in the perimeter zone. Since the configuration of these alarms are similar, I will take back to home or office template as example. Back to device page. Before configuring linkage alarm, make sure you have the permission to configure the devices. Otherwise, you have to apply for permissions first. For example, if I want to configure the SKH8520 device with the linkage lure, I will click Add Linkage Lure button here. After checking, enter linkage lure name. Select trigger source as DHKH8520 WTE1 and select event triggered by the device, such as calling. Of course, each type of device supports different events. Then configure the linkage actions such as linkage of speed door to capture pictures. And then define the scheduled time during which the linkage is active. If you have enabled linkage lure, make sure notification function of the source is enabled. If the predefined template cannot meet your needs, you can customize linkage lures as you desired. This is an introduction to cross-device linkage. Thank you for watching.